Hi friends, welcome to Kalas Kitchen. Today I am showing in my video what I have kept for my kid in the lunchbox. Finding ideas for kids lunchbox or snack is one of the challenging tasks for many moms, especially if the kids are fussy or demanding. As moms, we are more interested to load their boxes with nutrition and want to make it interesting for the kids. I have a complete collection of recipes for kids that are good for lunchbox, snack and even dinner too. These recipes have been tried for my kids and the ones liked by them are here on this video. I have put together some of my recipes that are good for lunch boxes. All these are mostly Indian that can be made in less than an hour. I personally do not prefer pasta and noodles in kids school lunch box. They are not healthy as well. Kids are different from some like eat only rice based dishes as they are lazy to chew chapati or roti or bread and they feel rice can be finished faster. While some like to eat only finger foods like roti or roti rolls or sandwiches. After a short survey talking to other moms, I have understood that most of the kids love to munch on some finger foods like roti rolls, sandwich or burger so that they could rest to play in the leisure. Here I made a bread sandwich which do not need much kneading and soaking time too. Yet they turned out to be mouth melting. If you want or if you wish you can include more veggies. I have cut the prepared sandwich into four parts so that it can be easily chewable and can be easily eaten by the children. Now place a kadai over medium flame and melt butter or ghee in it. When the butter or ghee has melted, add one chopped onion, fry for a minute, then add a pinch of turmeric powder, salt as per taste. You can add any masalas or spices as you wish. Here I have added only kali mich powder. Now add one chopped capsicum and one chopped tomato. Let it fry for 5 minutes by continuous stirring. Cover it with a lid and cook for 5 more minutes. You can add corn, carrot or whatever veggies you want to this stuffing. You can also add some mixed herbs here and give a good mix. You can use any quick cool mixed vegetables of your choice. This veg sandwich can be made with a single veggie like carrot or bell pepper or sweet corn alone. You can also use the pre-chopped mixed veggies from the frozen section. Feel free to use any cheese of your choice to make a cheese veggie sandwich. You can also use any green chutney if you have in hand. Just spread it over the bread and then add all the sorted vegetables. For earlier option, make the veg sandwich with brown bread or whole wheat grain bread. You can also make this in a sandwich toast. Once the veggies are sorted, you can add boiled and mashed potato and stir for 5 minutes. Mix it well and cook for 5 more minutes. Now your sandwich stuffing is ready. You can stuff it in between the two slices of bread and cut it in a triangular shape and serve. This veg sandwich recipe is super quick to make even by a newbie as it only need basic ingredients. This sandwich, these vegetable sandwiches can be enjoyed for breakfast or as a snack. Place two slices and transfer the veggies over them. If you wish, you can add cheese and then sprinkle now. Place another slice of bread, press down gently. If using cheese, toast it on a low heat without burning until the cheese melts. Alternatively, you can use a grill sandwich maker. Comforting curd rice is a popular dish from South India where soft cooked rice is mixed with yogurt and then tempered with spice. The process of making curd rice is pretty simple and straightforward. 
first the rice is cooked with more water than you normally would because the rice is cooked with extra water it's quite soft and that's the consistency you want for curd rice tempering or tatka refers to the process of adding seasoning to the dish in the end and is an integral part of the indian cuisine for the tatka i used mustard seeds urad dal curry leaves and dried red chilies here i avoided them instead of dried red chilies i have used chopped green chili and i also added some ginger for extra taste you may also use chana dal cumin seeds or hing in the tempering there's no hard and fast rule so you use what you like now add salt per taste and add the cooked rice to it i added 1 and 1/2 cups of milk adding milk is optional but i added for the consistency and flavor some people also add in butter to their curd rice for the extra creaminess however i generally keep it simple without the butter then i added 1 to 3 tablespoon of yogurt then it is mixed with the rice the next step is so add any veggies that you would like i know some people keep it keep it super simple and add nothing at all So then it's just plain curd rice with a tempering of mustard seeds and curry leaves. I have added grated carrots. You can also add cilantro and green chilies to my curd rice. You can also add some green peppers or cucumber to it. And like most of the Indian recipes serve with achar or papadam. This is the South India's ultimate comfort food where soft cooked rice is mixed with yogurt and then seasoned with spices. Taste best when chilled and with a side of papadam and pickle. If you have tried this curd recipe then don't forget to give a like or comment my recipe. You can also follow me on Facebook and Instagram to see what's latest in my kitchen. kids or fussy eaters in general but at school they also begin to compare their lunch box with that of other kids and let's face it most kids suffer from the grass is greener on the other side syndrome moms need to work on keeping the lunch box interesting and nutritious at the same time without having to spend hours in the kitchen for this purpose Cooking for kids can be a daunting task as kids prefer something new and different each time. Foods to be put in a lunch box. My suggestions include a fresh fruit, crunchy vegetables, protein food such as peanut butter or nut paste or a dry fruit ladoo, dairy food such as a cheese stick or a slice grated cheese, milk or yogurt. starchy food such as a bread a roll pita or flat bread fruit bread or crackers along with a water bottle if you like this video give a big thumbs up comment and share to your friends and relatives and also subscribe my youtube channel if you are seeing for the first time thank you